Alright, this is my Navita shield when you open it up. This is what it looks like. I think Navita shield has one of the best uh, software it looks like. There's Kodi that we use most of the time, but Chrome is where I just watched the Sharks game from San Francisco Bay Sports. Didn't pay a thing. Um, you can get games, you can watch YouTube. Screw Prime Video because you have to pay a subscription to that. But if you want to, you can do it from this little box that you get on Amazon. And the prices are um, probably 80 to a couple hundred bucks, depending what kind of remote controls and things you want. But here's the key, Kodi. When you open Kodi, Kodi is software that controls music, videos, weather, anything you want to watch and get off the internet for free. So these are little secondary software websites that help control what links you pull up because this box controls anything in the world that's on the web. So there's a lot of stuff out there. So I use a thing that it's called Track TV that organizes my movies and um, my TV. So when I go to my TV shows and go to TV show list and I have it by family members, I go to Will and um, here's the TV shows we want. Um, we don't pay for any of this. I don't have cable. You can click on Walking Dead. Um, all the seasons are there. Um, tells me when we've seen it. You just click through. And it will take a second to load all the people streaming it. And you'll see up here where it's saying there's a total of 57. Sometimes you'll get like, depending on what it is, like 400, 500 people streaming. Um, it shows there's six people streaming in it in 720, 69 people streaming in it in SD. Um, this is the one part that you may have to wait on. And it'll come up and here's all the people streaming. So I'm going to go down and pull up. The 720 links may not sometimes be as reliable as the others, but just for show purposes here, I'm going to go down to an SD um, thing. And it's going through a couple of them now, 8, 9, 10, if you see. And that you just sometimes have to log on that you're trying to go to the 1, 2, 3 movies thing. Or you can just cancel and wait a little bit longer, it'll work. Um, and here comes The Walking Dead. Um, the picture's perfect. And this is SD. It's not even the 720. Okay, so I'm going to back out, um, get back in the numbers, and back out, and back out, and back out. So the track TV thing, all it does for me is it just keeps track of all my movies and TV. Um, so if I want to go watch a movie, I do it much the same way. And I'm backing out here to get back to the movies. So my movies, I go down to movie list. And I have everything organized by people. Um, so I'll pull up movies that we're just haven't watched yet. Um, we take like our little classic follow the ones that we watch a lot. Um, so it will come up with all the movies. Um, and there's any movie in the world that you want to see. Um, I know that movie came up recently. Um, and I 
after you've seen the movie, you can delete it, whatever you want to do with it. Um, I'm just going to see if I could watch the movie now. Well, there's Despicable Me 3, that's older, but you'll see there's 2018 movies and stuff. Um, there's movies you can watch that are still in the theater. Um, so here there's so far 265 people streaming um, Despicable Me. And it does the same thing. All the numbers and the Cody thing does is it's just helping you find on the internet where these movies are being streamed. And just like the TV thing, it will come up and show you all the movies. I'm just going to click on a 720p link here. And it's searching through different ones right now. Um, I started at 7, went up to 14. So the software is improving all the time. Um, so nothing's downloaded. And here comes the movie now. I hope you can see the quality of this. It's 720. Um, I don't think the video, I'm watching it on the video, is as good as it is on the TV. It is perfectly clear uh, movie. Okay, So I'm going to back out of this again. But anything you want to watch in the world will be there. And it's free. Forget the Amazon Fire Stick. Forget paying a streaming fee from Hulu or whoever Netflix. You saw I had Netflix TV shows on there. Um, HBO shows on there. Um, there's anything you want. Sometimes if you don't get um, a good picture there, you can get it from somewhere else. If you go down here, you can download all these different things. The C Cloud thing, what this does, is it will bring TV um, to you, live sort of TV or TV shows. Um, from anywhere. There's Fox News, BBC, BB, ESPN, tons of CNN, tons of Fox. Um, so this is Fox Washington, Fox New York, Fox Atlanta, I mean Fox Denver. You can watch anything you want. Um, I've never really spent time here, um, but um, it works under the same premise, um, that it will pull it up. Okay, well they're on commercial break right now. So a lot of times when you're watching these TV shows, you don't get any commercials. Um, during the commercial, you'll get something like that. So that's Fox from New York. Um, their local station, and just like that, you can watch it live. Um, I'm not going to waste time waiting for the commercial. Um, but there's all these things that are downloaded. A lot of these just convert. Uh, here's CBC. Sometimes the Sharks games come in really good on CBC. Um, but you can get ESPN, anything you want. Um... Music, we don't play with it, but you can get music from anywhere, too. And here's Android apps. Um, I think my son's downloaded a few games. With the apps, I do believe you have to pay the fee for that. Uh, but you click out of Cody. And my 
like they say, you go to Chrome, you can get anything you want on Chrome. Um, oh yeah, I think uh, he downloaded this Bomb Squad game. I played it with him. Um, but there's games, there's music, there's, there's so much on here. Um, you, you can't, it's, it's really hard to keep track of it. Thus the software from Nvidia Shield, thus Cody, thus Chrome trying to keep track of everything that's going on. Um, that's a 10 minute video, but um, a lot of people asking for it, so there it is.